Hey there, how is everyone doing? I am DCSK. In this video, I will show you guys on how to beat the Hus of Elder Gaspar in Last E4. He is located at the Chamber of Ruin, level 90 Monolith, the last ruin timeline. We are going to fight him in one phase only, and before the fight begins, let's learn about his ability so that you can beat him much easier. He specialized in area attack, also can teleport with void explosion. His signature move is a combined elemental beam, which he casts in all three elements while slowly spinning around. He can channel the power of ice to prepare snow cascade that travel in random direction toward the outside of the arena. He can also plant destructive flame totem that emits a fire burst. He also throw lightning trap that explodes upon contact with a delay, but this can indefinitely in the arena. He can create three large but well telegraphed explosions around the arena that do high world damage. Then a word wind is formed on the outside of the arena that persists for several seconds and deal high void damage that increase over its duration. And that's all his abilities. He deals uh, immense void damage and elemental damage. So you need this for resistance. Get it as high as you can, better max it, and at least 1500 HP and above for better survivability. Also, it is much easier to evade his ability with high movement speed. And that's all you need to know. Now I'm gonna show you guys on how I beat him. And this is my character. I'm using Rogue. Level 86. Uh, it is uh, under level because the boss is at uh, the map is uh, level 90. It's okay. I still uh, can beat him with at this level. And uh, this is my resistance, fire, lightning, coal. Uh, the coal is the worst one, so I gotta be careful of that. Uh, but still, I have to be careful for, uh, on the uh, fire element from the boss and also lightning. And the void uh, resistance already max 75%. I still have to be careful because uh, I still receive uh, great damage from the boss. And I only have 1002 HP. Alright, uh, I'm able to beat him. Now I'm gonna show you guys. Just make sure to evade all his incoming abilities. Right, here we are, the Elder Gaspar. Right, wake up. Right, here he comes. Make sure to evade all his abilities. Okay, just stand close here. So that it will be uh, much easy for you to uh, evade this elemental beam from him. This one you can stand in between. The power of ice tornado that is casting from him. Careful what he's gonna do next. Okay, the flame totem. Just stay out of the range and also destroy the flame totem. Now you gotta stay in the middle because there is a white word wind outside of the arena. It is making the arena smaller. Whoa, careful. That white arrow. Here comes the elemental beams. Gotta be careful of that uh, lightning trap. Whoop, 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 whoopsie. Yeah, just stand in between this power of ice tornado. Gotta destroy some of the flame totem. Otherwise, once the arena getting smaller, it will be a uh, tough for you. Where are you going? I think I got him. Yeah, almost just a little bit. Yeah, stay close. Just a little bit more. What's he's gonna do next? Okay, he's casting the uh, flame totem. Here comes the white wind. Hey, okay, he's gone, guys. I got him. Yep. Easy busy. Yeah, wow, I got a set item from the boss. Okay, let's see what I got. 15% increase of shot drop rate. Well, shot drop rate. Okay, what about this one? Yeah, I prefer this one. Increase class specific shot drop rate. Right, I'm getting this one. Alright, guys. That's how you can beat the Elder Gaspar. Okay, I hope you all enjoyed this video and get to learn uh, how to build it uh, much easy. And uh, if you guys enjoy my content, make sure to smash a like to the video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much for the support. Any question or suggestion, you can leave a comment below. And uh, I'm gonna see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. See ya. Tata. -ta.